Hello, I'm Don Jolly and I'm still trying to get Cheltenham ready. In the last step, I got my outfit sorted. In this step, I'm at Fergal O'Brien's farm and basically he's a big trainer. He's got three horses running today in the Cheltenham trials. We're going to go meet him, try and find a winner and see what happens. How do you make a horse race? Now this bit, I know, these are horses. So this is a horse, definitely. Morning. Morning. Jockey. See, I know all this stuff. Are you Fergal? I'm Fergal. Hello. You? I'm Good very nice to meet you. I'm Dom. I know nothing about racing, so... That makes two of us. Yeah, really. <laughs> you got three horses running today, have you? We have, yeah. We've what are they called? Perfect Candidate. Yeah. Colin's sister and I.I. Charlie. This is Colin's sister. So Colin's sister has been a very good mare to She's a homebred. And she's won probably seven or eight races for us. Okay, and so she's supposed to have a good chance? Yeah, or? she's got her best chance. Really? Today, yeah. All right. I'm relying on you, yeah? Ooh. That went well. <laughs> <laughs> We're going down to see them gallop now, are we? Yeah. Or will they gallop or just... Yeah, some of them will be galloping, yeah. Are you sort of checking for injuries, checking for how they're running? Yeah, or? you're checking to see how they're striding out and how they're, how they're moving, and the lads will tell you if they're not moving very well. And do you uh, have a bet yourself? Are you allowed no, to bet? No, I am allowed to bet, but I don't bet, no. I'm a, you don't? No, I'm a terrible tipster, so... Really? Mug's game? It's a mug's game. Oh, yeah. no, I'm here for tips. <laughs> what? <laughs> Never eat yellow snow. OK, thanks. <laughs> Is that a horse? <laughs> <laughs> Saturday Night Fever, Luna June. Lily's on... Yeah. Do I get the feeling you don't actually know the names first? No, you're I don't. Being, you're being... <laughs> I've been prompted. You're being helped here. If you get a winning horse, what are you looking at? Well, on an average day today, you know, you're talking maybe two and three grand, but the, the Grand National is anything from, you know, I think the Grand National is like 600,000 to the winner. 600 grand? Yeah, yeah. Wow. This is all fascinating stuff, but I think I've seen what I need, to be honest. I might just go in the bus if that's all right. Yeah, you've got to keep warm. Is that okay? Yes, I just Am I going to get run over? No. 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 Run. All right. <laughs> I waited for three hours and this bus did not move. Uh, so I'm trying to get Cheltenham ready, but I basically know nothing about the racing thing. So you're the first jockey I've met. But what do I look for in a jockey? In a jockey, you have quite slightly quieter riders and obviously slightly more aggressive riders. But when you go to Cheltenham and the festival, one thing you can guarantee you're going to be dealing with the best um, in whatever horse it's on in whatever race. As a jockey, obviously there's you know there's the pride and stuff like that. But presumably you win some of the if you win, do you get some of the prize money? Yeah, we we get looked after, so we get a basic riding fee for every ride we take, and then if we win a um, a, bit, a race. We get, eight, 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 I think it's nearly eight percent of the prize money. Which is not bad when you think sometimes what gold cups, what four hundred thousand pounds. Gold cups or a lot of money, but so it's... I can't do eight percent four hundred thousand. Yeah. But yeah, that's all right. <laughs> that's yeah, a yeah. very hard to place in. If you can get a yeah, good ride course. in the gold cup, then yeah, to win the gold cup would be it would be a dream. Virgil, is this another one running today? This is I.I. Charlie, yeah. I.I. Charlie's got a famous brother called Chase the Spud who won the Midlands Grand National for us last year at Utoxeter. He was third at Cheltenham the last day. Right. So yeah, third at Cheltenham the last day. He's just day. having a word. Hang on. Yeah, he's yeah. he's fancying himself today. Should I? Does he? Is he worth a, worth a punt or? He's worth an each way bet. Yeah, each way. Yeah, because he's about twenty to one, I think. So he's he's definitely worth each Boy. way. And to be, he's got to finish in the first three. Good stuff. Thanks for that. Should we go and see Perfect Candidate? Yeah, why not? He's our other one. So this is the third one running today? Yeah, this is Perfect Cannon. This is our highest rated horse. This fellow ran in the Grand National last year. How'd he do? Uh, he pulled up, actually. Grand National's difficult, though, isn't it? I mean, it's, yeah, it's, it's, it's a big one. He didn't have a great preparation, but he's been right. a very good horse for us. Like I say, he is our highest rated horse. He's rated 156. Right. Um, what does so, that mean? Uh, the, so the top horse like the border are in the one sort of 70s. Right. So, he, so he's really, this is top notch. Yeah, he's, he's getting there, you know. Yeah, and he's worth a good punt, do you think? No, I don't think he will no. be. No. No, I don't. He'll be 33 to 1, and we got to, he's just got to get back on track. He had a poor run the last day. So of the three today, which yeah. is the best bet? Colin's sister. Colin's sister? Yeah. For a win? For a win, yeah. And, and then, unfortunately, and I'll save my money for a drink for this yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. Hopefully, Perfect Canada will get around and pick us up a bit of prize money, because okay. it's nice and local. Amazing. All right, well, thanks very much. Cheers. Yeah, thanks for coming up. Call me a loser again. Go on. Looking a couple more here. Who's this one? This is The Name Evades Me. <laughs> they're beautiful horses, though, aren't they? You can see they're highly trained. Here's this one. Oh, it's Jeff. Hey, Jeff. Wonder where you got to last night. Right, so I've now got suited and booted. I've met a horse. I'm nearly Cheltenham ready. All I've got to do now is walk the talk. No, talk the walk. You know what I mean, the lingo.